Good morning. Welcome to Goodwill Commodities. In this video presentation, we are going to see how we can trade in MCX crude oil today. Before looking into that, let us see what happened yesterday and what we expected yesterday. Whenever I place the cursor on any candlestick, you can see the date and time below. You can see this red color candlestick that indicates yesterday's price opening, which shows that the market opened somewhere around 6040s. So what we expected yesterday, we expected that crude has got the complete potential to continue its downturn having 6665 we had marked this as a resistance zone and we had clearly identified unless until the price breaks 6120 you don't have any opportunity for buying so that was our clear position and if the price is falling uh, the expected zone as you know we had marked all the expected zone 6020 and 6000 and uh, bottom uh, it can possibly reach 5060 so this was uh, our expectation and you know this 6000 is going to be a big psychological zone now let us see what happened after that after the price opening you can see that slowly the price is climbing and it's trying to hit the resistance zone this will happen in any market because if you know see the price opening yesterday's price opening there was some gap the yesterday's market opened below the previous day's price closing so the price gave a bounce back and exactly it went and tried to hit the resistance zone so as you all know that uh, we are drawing all the support and resistance zone manually using our experience and uh, on seeing the histories of chart so after here hitting the resistance zone and even if you see that our charting platform has got the ability even if it provides you a buy signal then you can follow all the levels that is what we are repeatedly saying that good <coughs> in goodwill commodities we are providing you a charting platform which can which can provide you signals based upon the momentum and pulse of the market during the trading time based upon the levels we are providing video presentations so if you can see both the things together you will get an accurate result so now you can see after hitting the resistance the price is coming down again and testing the 6020 now we can see it is now converted into a resistance zone this is a pure example how slowly and steadily all the supports are converted into resistance now you can see that after coming down here a little bit of resistance here push the price towards the psychological 6000 zone as usual since it is a psychological zone the market stayed here for a while and as you all know yesterday we had crude oil inventory report also so many times we had mentioned that sorry so that can really push the price down now you can see slowly the price is converting this 6000 into a resistance zone after dropping down price is bouncing back and from here the 6000 the price is coming down so this was converted into resistance so the price was pushed towards 5060 5960 now we can see then after there was a bit of consolidation from here the price gave a bounce back and there was a struggle in and around 6000 zone and the price closed around 6020 so this was the entire price action that happened in crude oil market yesterday as we expected the price completely dominated by the buyers the price was completely dominated by the sellers sorry the price was completely dominated by the sellers there was no scope for buying in the early session but whatever happened under price closing time it's a just a bit of consolidation so what we can do today there is no doubt about uh, the crude oil yesterday was dominated by the sellers how we can position ourselves for today as we always say that uh, there are two areas uh, traders will find it very difficult uh, for trading uh, that depends upon the available funds in the trading account that is whenever the price is consolidating and the second after the price has reached its maximum trend zone which means after a very big moment there will always be a pullback so that if you are re late in reacting to any position uh, it, there are a lot of chances that your stop loss might be triggered so what how you can escape from that the only thing that can help you is that mastering the support resistance and levels so in this video presentation we are providing you uh, entire clear outlook about the support resistance and the key zones um, so and we also provide you the reason behind that so how we can do position yourself uh, the today's price opening uh, is expected to be more or less near the same zone 6020 hopefully it will be a continuation of what happened on the previous days so there is no change in our position or uh, we are not going to change our stance unless until the price breaks 6120 we expect the price to stay in downtrend if you are uncertain about the trend direction or if you think that uh, 
the price has dropped uh, so uh, since the price has dropped along and the price has reached the psychological zone you can stay away from the market wait for the price to consolidate and then you can re-enter or else wait for the price to uh, come and touch near this uh, key zones and then we can trade uh. so as far as our analysis are concerned crude always has got the ability to stay in downtrend there is no clear confirmation for any reversal uh, repeatedly we keep on saying that if you want to take any entry it is based upon a few facts uh, or there should be a strong reason behind taking a trade entry so there is no reason uh, to take a buy entry here but if there is a strong momentum what we can do for today is that uh, so you can very well notice that the price was tra trading within this zone so yesterday on seeing the entire price action we can say that the price most of the time it consolidated this is the only area where the price gave some buying so there was some buying happening in this area but uh, we don't uh, recommend um, to go and trade against the trend but uh, if you want to do buying or something so if the price is staying above this zone please go for it if the price is staying below this there is no chance for buying at all there will be strong buying happening only after the price breaks 6120 so this is going to be the key zone which will decide the trend or key resistance area for this contract so let us see what's going to happen during the trading session and thanks a lot for watching our videos happy trading take care bye